with EMDI Cooperative Services, and joining me today is Liz Laughlin from DWR, part of Avantour. Welcome, Liz. Thanks for having me, Nicole. Sure. So let's tell us, what is the trend that is currently having the biggest impact on higher education? Great question. Top of mind for our customers and market is uniform guidance. And uniform guidance is a federal regulation issued by the Council on Financial Assistance Reform, COFAR. It was released in 2014 and enacted for compliance effective July 1st, 2018. And it applies to all higher education institutions receiving federal and state monies. And the intent is to provide a framework for grants management and to centralize and consolidate the regulations and mitigate risk of fraud and abuse of federal funding. And so as we think about the impact to institutions in 2019, many institutions do not have the systems and processes in place to readily adhere to uniform guidance. And so when it comes to uniform guidance, how can DWR help? Another great question, Nicole. We can assist customers in meeting their uniform guidance needs using the ENI contract that was competitively bid and awarded in the summer of 2018. And the agreement covers our full suite of lab supplies and products and services. And it's imperative that we bring forward solutions that increase efficiency and optimize resources. And so the uniform guidance language actually explicitly calls out that universities can utilize cooperative, consortium, and GPO contracts that have undergone a formal bid process. And so all proposals were scored against a variety of criteria. For example, breadth and depth of product, value-added solutions, discounts, and incentives. And Ian and I took it a step further to provide supporting documentation from a third party to show how ENI's bid processes actually align with the uniform guidance. And so we're having one-on-one -on -one discussions about the ENI contract with the institutions to understand their needs and really look forward to doing that this year and into next year. Excellent, Liz. Thank you so much for chatting with us today. Thank you so much for having me. It was really a pleasure.